Hello, welcome. It's a new week. It's Monday. It was a long week. A lot of wars, a lot of contests. Anyways, um, this is a, just about two cloning apps that I have previously mentioned that I'm now using in addition to the other cloning apps that I gave you. There was, I think, six or seven cloning apps in my cloning app series. Well, I've been using Octopus and a new one called App Hider, so I just wanted to show you them. Um, I made an icon for Octopus on my home screen so I know which app it is. But it looks like this. Um, the actual app looks like this. Okay, so, and the App Hider app looks like this. It's called App Hider. And both of these you can find at uh, Game Guardian Tutorial, I'm sorry, GameGuardian.net. In the virtual space download page, you just, on the main page, you scroll down and it shows you a virtual space link. And it'll start with, it'll say like parallel space, parallel space light. And you click on that, those red links and it'll take you to the virtual space page and you can find Octopus and App Hider. Now, the only thing about those two apps I just wanted to mention is that Octopus and App Hider, they come with a Facebook login, the Google Play login doesn't work unfortunately google play login doesn't work but i just found out in octopus which i'm going back to my home screen because i made a new i make um icons so i know which city is which um using app hider i'm using icon changer i'm sorry icon changer is the app i use so these are my cities right here And um, those, how I distinguish which app is which, because it's kind of hard to tell. So the first one, this is parallel. Um, the first app I have, I have four, five clones on this device. Now this is a, a device that I use for other cities and the first app um, right here that is parallel space but I just changed the icon to the name of the city the second app is right here parallel space light and that's for my city mysterious the first one was Sol Luna the third one is this is App Hider. It doesn't look anything like the app because I changed the icon. So that's my third city, Pineapple. And then the fourth city is right here. And I use Icon Changer once again for Octopus. This is Octopus. So it helps to make... Um, use icon changer to so you can edit the name of the app if you have multiple cloning apps on your device and you know which app is which because if it just says parallel space you're like which parallel space which city and if you're using if you play multiple cities it helps to organize it like that and so that's that and then the fourth those are, the fourth one is island right here and I haven't entered a city in that yet okay so let's show you um, I, I'm gonna start with octopus because there is something new with octopus I just found out today so we open it unfortunately it does have ads But you can 
didn't skip it. Okay, so today I just found out that you can, next week, which would be the week of February 20th or 24th or something like that, right here, they're going to be releasing Octopus with Google Play login. Hello. That's what we want because it's much easier to make cloning apps and save your progress with a Google Space login if you don't have a Facebook account. So and it's the one of the only cloning apps <clears throat> out of the ones, the newer ones that I mentioned that a, a Google Play login will work. So I first mentioned that Currently, it doesn't have, Octopus currently doesn't have a Google Play login. But with this new release coming out next week, it will. Now, it says Octopus Gamepad Pro. Um, with, uh, it's a public gaming thing without a ban. So you have to experiment with that. It might be another option in octopus a feature of octopus where you have to pay to use that plugin i don't know i don't use that all i know is that when the google play login feature comes out i will be using that so let's log in to octopus so you just click here's my city now inside the game it doesn't give you the feature to rename it but Knox does but I I still have any problems oh my God. Really? <laughs> that was kind of funny anyways so after the ad shows then you can open the city Come on. Sometimes I have to just close everything and then restart. Watch the app completely. Why is it? Yeah, so see, so it gives you reward points. Why is it not opening? Let me pause the video. I gotta wait for the ad, so that's. I try. I I had I had to boost my RAM. Huh. Well, it usually opens just fine. Okay. Well, scratch that. It works, guys. It works. Let me just scratch that and let's go to App Hider. It's not opening for whatever reason. I don't want to restart the phone for the video because that's going to take too long. So, um, this is how App Hider works. It's very cool. It, it changes the actual icon to a calculator. <laughs> and then you enter a, a, a password or digits that you're calculating. It's kind of funny. I like that. And then this one, you don't, the ads don't let, make you have to watch them. So I, App Hider is just slightly above the rank than Octopus in that sense, but they both work the same. So you just click on the icon and then launch it. But, um, like I said, the Facebook login and the works but not the Google Play you 
before the this video is over, I'm going to try to open Octopus just to show you the city. These are um, two new cities and two new clubs. And um, this city is coming along pretty cool. Um, I've been unlocking a lot of buildings a lot in landscape and parks and stuff. And um, I'm up to population a million, one, 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 nine, seven, three. And I got that population like within a week. So when you edit your game, you can do that. And I'm not banned yet from my club. But here's what I also secondly important that I want to mention. Um... Besides the two cloning apps, App Hider and Octopus, when you edit your city and you level up to 39 and you do all that and you start editing your city and you start changing the values, SimCity knows. So your trade depot is not going to work. And don't edit your war cards because you'll get banned. Now, in a couple cities, I've edited my war cards and I have not got banned, but it was just luck of the draw because sometimes the remote login is online, even though you might be offline, like they, they know when you edit the war card. So be very, very careful so you don't, um, get booted out of your club. So I just, you know... All these things down here, like all the beach items, I didn't pay for them. And all of the plum bots or any of the um, entertainment, I didn't pay for the football fields because I am in the Sim City sign and the dragon lights and this little movie um, studio statue and the dragons. I unlocked those using Game Guardian didn't pay for them. So, um, but my trade depot doesn't work. So, cause they know once you have, if you look in my storage, I have everything edited. So I have my product stocked. I got all the war parts and I unlocked one region, um, which is Frosty Ford's. So, your trade depot won't work. You won't get banned from the club. Now, this club is on the nice side, okay? And it's not on the banned side, but it is edited and it's working. And I'm at a war right now. Um, I only have seven energy, so we're losing pretty bad. It's 62,000 versus 93,000. Unfortunately, we're getting slammed because this club is pretty huge. We got 18 people and they got 12. But out of our 18 people, a lot of people aren't don't play as much in this club because they're they're working people and they have families and children. So just want to show you that. So once again, your trade depot won't work if you edit your city on the nice side because they will notice it and it will get banned. But I just wanted to show you the city, how nice it's looking. I think it's looking pretty cool. And um, so that is pineapple. Okay, so let's, it's raining. Let me just exit out of here. And then let me try to log into Octopus again. Because I really wanted to make sure that you guys see that. Close video. See, it, want, it wants you to watch the video. can close it
is it going to load? Hmm. Interesting. Maybe because I got three octopuses open. It says my memory is at one gig RAM, so let's try opening it over here. just logged into the game. I don't know why it's tripping. I have to restart the phone. Anyways, that's it. So Octopus and App Hider, you guys, um, I suggest that. Oh, and also I mentioned get the new release of Game Guardian 73.7 because... 73.6 has some crash serious bugs so get 73.7 of game guardian okay thank you for watching i'll be back